Atlantic salmon traditions. You heard me mention this before. I'm 65 years old. Back when I first started fly fishing at 12 years old, that's the uh, late 1960s for, all fo for you folks that are terrible at math like I am. Uh, believe it or not, back then, and this is not just fisher folk, but biologists considered steelhead to be a relative of the Atlantic salmon. So it's no big uh, surprise that a lot of our fly fishing traditions come from Atlantic salmon fishing. But many, many moons later, it was the Russians that genetically solved the mystery that, sorry, steelhead are their own gig. They are not related to the Atlantic salmon. They are actually the pre predecessor to the five Atlantic or five Pacific salmon. They're their own gig. That didn't go down well with most of us steelheaders, including myself back in the day. We're like, what? No, they're, they're, they're related to the Atlantic salmon. But after a while, it sunk in. And uh, some of us literally just got to the point where we're like, you're right, they're not Atlantic salmon. Maybe we should be looking at them as their own thing. And that's when we started learning things. Learning things like, I don't know, a friend of Jerry's, a biologist, or Jerry talked to a biologist one time that's, that you know, told him about the percentage of the diet of a steelhead that consisted of prawns and then also squid. And guess what we started doing? Ta -da! Ta -da 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 -da! Yep, we started. This is where these ideas came from. We didn't want to, we didn't set out to specifically look exactly like a prawn or a squid, but just get the general, general movement and shape. And look at that, general movement and shape, all right? General movement and shape. To give you an idea of kind of what, one of the little things that kind of spurred us to look in a different direction, to start considering them as their own fish, was reading the old time books and finding out that back in the day, back way before any of us, back before any of the old boys like Lemire or Strobel, back when it was literally first being settled out here in, in British Columbia, was before any of this down here, that that was all settled by the Brits, the British guys. And they tried fly fishing for our salmon and steelhead, and they considered them, I hate, uh, I'm gonna cuss here, they considered our Pacific salmon and steelhead shit because they couldn't do well on them with a fly rod because they were fishing for them like they were Atlantic salmon. All right, so I'm not gonna sit there. All I'm gonna say is literally for those of you, and don't get me wrong, if you wanna fish, if you wanna continue that tradition, that's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. I'm just saying for those of you that don't wanna fish, don't feel, you know, explore, do different stuff. These are not Atlantic salmon. They're completely different fish, all right? So start your own tradition. Start a steelhead tradition. 